my choice is you, oh God. Lift your hands and make a my choice. My choice way. is you, oh God. Early in the morning, down to the noontime, even in the night time. My choice is you, O oh God. My choice is you, O oh God. My choice is you, O oh God. Early in the morning, all down to the noontime. Even in the night time, my choice is you, God. My hope is you, oh God. My hope is you, oh God. Early in the morning. And down in the noon time, even in the night time, my hope is you, oh God. Send my hope, my choice is you, oh Lord. My reply is you, oh God. Yelling in the morning. Every day, every time. And down in the noon time. When it is the night time. Oh, my reply is you, oh God. My choice is you, oh God. My choice is you, oh Jesus. Hell in the morning. And down in the noontime. And even in the night time. 
you've got a whole Africa. You've got a whole white nation. Heavenly Father, your name. Oh, we worship you. Sire Oluwa Oba to fi mo le sasobura Ka bi e Sire Oluwa Oba to fi mo le sasobura To fi mo le sasobura Oba to fi mo le saso Ka bi e Sire Sire Oba won ba Sire, we give the praise, celebrate Jesus, it's worthy to be praised. Hallelujah. Oh yeah, the when the spirit of the Lord is upon my soul, celebrate Jesus. When the spirit of the Lord is upon my soul, are we there? Are we there? When the spirit of the Lord is upon my soul, when the spirit of the Lord is upon my soul, are we there? We give the praise. We have a Are we there? Are we there? Let us sing. Hallelujah. Let us sing. Hallelujah to the Lord. Let us dance. Hallelujah. Let us dance. Hallelujah to the Lord. Jesus is worthy to be praised. King of glory. Everlasting Father is worthy to be praised. King of glory, ever children of God, shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Children of God, shout hallelujah. Children of God, shout hallelujah. Children of God, shout hallelujah. 
Father, we give you all the glory, we give you all adoration. Thank you for another brand new day. Please accept our praises, accept our worship for in Jesus' most wonderful name we have worship. Amen. It is time for intercessory prayer. You're welcome to morning dew. Psalm 1, Psalm 19, verse 2. Day unto day uttereth speech, and night unto night showeth knowledge. Shall we lift up our voice to God and say, My Father, my God, let this day speak goodness and mercy into my life and my family. In the mighty name of Jesus, my Father, my God, let the day speak goodness and mercy into my life, into my family. In the name of Jesus, Mashatale Baruta, Zekete Legedegedosh, Ikarota Bozia Malata Mashida, Hekata Legariga de Gedosha. Father, let today speak goodness, speak mercy into my life and in my family. In the name of Jesus, let today speak goodness, speak mercy into my life, into my family. In the name of Jesus, my Father, my God, let this day speak goodness, speak mercy into my life, into my family. Family. In the name of Jesus, Le Barabarosha, Hale Gazota, Eli Barata, Mashida Posenti, La Gada Garagarosha, Ikatos Maseta, Ipata Legedosha, my Father, my God, let today speak goodness, speak mercy into my life, into my life, and in my family. In the name of Jesus, my Father, my God, let today speak goodness, speak mercy into my life, into my family. In the name of Jesus, Mashida. Shakatarabadosa, Eliba Zuta Egadosa, Hayagada Gadagadosha, La Carata Boziata, Ipato Mazanta Legadosha, Halegete Geregadosa, Ereke Tegeregadosa, in the name of Jesus.
Jesus, let today speak goodness, speak mercy into my life and in my family. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Deuteronomy chapter 12, verse 3. And ye shall overthrow their altars, and break their pillars, and burn their groves with fire. And ye shall hew down the graven images of their gods, and destroy the names of them out of that place. Lift up your voice to God and say, My Father, my God, let every gate of hell and an altar of witchcraft arrayed against your church, God's city international church, be scattered and cast fire. In the mighty name of Jesus, my Father, my God, let every gate of hell and every altar of witchcraft arrayed against your church, God City International Church, be scattered, catch fire, 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 be scattered, and catch fire. In the name of Jesus, my Father, my God, let every gate of hell and all altar of witchcraft arrayed against your church, God City International Church, be scattered and catch fire. In the name of Jesus, shaka. Ayagadosa, Maleboria Bozinta, Ikado Mazita, Altar of Witchcraft, Arena Against Your Church, God City International Church, Cast Fire, Scatter, Cast Fire, Scatter, Cast Fire, Scatter, Cast Fire, Scatter, in the name of Jesus, all gate of hell against your church, Cast Fire, Scatter, in the name of Jesus, Marete Bozita, Zakali Gadosa, Hapata Moziata, Ikado Mazente, Lagadiska Moshi. Every gate of hell, an altar of witchcraft, arranged against your church, God City International Church, cast cutter, cast, cast fire, in the name of Jesus, be scattered and cast fire, be scattered and cast fire, be scattered and cast fire, be scattered and cast fire. fire. Thank you, mighty God, for in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Acts of the Apostle chapter 2, verse 41 and verse 47. Then they that gladly receive his word, we are baptized. And the same day they were added unto them about 3,000 souls, verse 47. Praising God and having favor with all the people. And the Lord added to the church daily such as should be saved. Lift up your voice to God and say, my Father, my God. We ask that this month of April, you multiply and enlarge the coast of your church, God's City International Church, in salvation of souls and discipleship. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, my Father, my God. We ask that this month, you multiply and enlarge the coast of your church, God's City International Church, in salvation of Source and discipleship in the name of Jesus. Le Kazote Porete, Jacata Legarosa, Marete Posilia Gadosa. Father, we ask that this month you multiply and enlarge the coast of your church, God City International Church, in salvation of souls and discipleship in the name of Jesus. La Gadagarabadiska, El Legadoska Posente, Jacata Lagadiska, Ayagadiska, Marete Posente, La Gadoska Moshida. My Father, my God, we ask that this month you multiply and enlarge the coast of your church, God's city, international church, in salvation of souls and discipleship in the name of Jesus. La Gada Garota, Habazente Bozita, Ikato Legediga, Jacata Mazata, Baria Galete Egezunta, Ikete Bozente Legedosa, La Gada Gada Gadigada, Eketo Garia Garosa, Le Gazita, Father, we we ask that this month of April you multiply and enlarge the coast of your church, God's City International Church, in salvation of souls and discipleship. In the name of Jesus, thank you, mighty God, for in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Lastly, Proverbs chapter 4, verse 18. Proverbs chapter 4, verse 18. But the path of the just is as a shining light that shineth more and more to the perfect day. Lift up your voice to God and say, My Father and my God, we make a demand for your raw power that will make all things possible and unstoppable progress for every attendee and all participant in today our possibility. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, my Father and my God, we make a demand for your raw power 
that will make all things possible and unstoppable progress for every attendee and participant in today our possibilities in the name of Jesus. My Father, my God, we make a demand for your raw power that will make all things possible and unstoppable progress for every attendee and all participant in today's our possibility in the name of Jesus. Father, we make a demand for your raw power that will make all things possible and unstoppable progress for every attendee and all participant in today our possibility. In the name of Jesus, Shakataska Balita, Ikadoska Borete, Zagalegedosha, Halia Gadata, Lekezanta Barita, Jagalagadagadosa, Marete Bozinta, Ikado Mazanta, Ikale Gadeska, Jagalagadaska, Lea Barata Bazata. We make a demand, mighty God, for your raw power that will make all things possible and unstoppable progress for every attendee and participant in today our possibility. In the name of Jesus, thank you, mighty Father. Thank you for answered prayers. For in Jesus' most wonderful name, we are prayed. Three giants, amen. Amen, amen, and amen. Celebrate Jesus with a clap offering. And please do have your seats. Hallelujah. Let's celebrate Jesus and give him praise. It is a beautiful Wednesday morning, and it is time to take our Power Touch daily devotional. And the prophetic word this morning is, what is obedience? It is a question. What is obedience? Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 1. Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 1. And it shall come to pass, if thou shalt hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord thy God, to observe and to do all his command, commandment which I command thee this day, that the Lord thy God will set thee on high above all nations of the earth. Amen. Words of wisdom. The master secret of getting to the topmost top in life is complete and total obedience. The grace to obey God totally, the Lord will give unto us in the name of Jesus. Obedience is the condition of daily working with God for perfection. Condition of daily working with God for perfection. Genesis chapter 17 verse 1. It says, And when Abraham was 90 years old and nine, the Lord appeared to Abraham and said unto him, I am the almighty God. Walk before me and be thou perfect. It is making sure that you are standing right with God daily. Obedience is making sure that you are standing right with God every day. Obedience is surrendering to the will of your maker. Matthew chapter 26 verse 39. And he went a little further and fell on his face and prayed saying, Oh my father, if it is be possible... Let this cup pass from me. Nevertheless, not as I will, but as thou willest. Obedience is doing the will of God even when it clashes with your own will. Number two, obedience is a state of wholeheartedly doing the will of God and his instruction. Doing the will of God and his instruction. Romans chapter 6 verse 17 says, But God be thanked. That ye were the servant of sin, but you have obeyed from the heart that, that form of doctrine which was delivered unto you. You only obey God when you carry out the instruction with your own heart. You only obey God when you carry the instruction of God with your own heart. That is, doing everything without grumbling. Number three. Obedience is doing whatever pleases your creator. Obedience is doing whatever pleases your creator. Hebrews chapter 11 verse 5. By faith, Enoch was translated that he should not see death and was not found because God has translated him. For before his translation, he had this testimony that he pleased God. May the grace to please God at all time rest upon you in the name of Jesus. I can't hear your amen. Even when God has not given instruction, 
or commanded it, you do it and make him happy. That is highest level of obedience. God has not spoken, but you just think that if I do this thing, God will be happy. You have obeyed God. What our assignment this morning, number one, have your heart renewed always. Have your heart renewed always. Number two, seek for the spirit of obedience because there is a spirit of obedience. Let's be all standing as we pray the following prayer. Let's stand up. Let's stand up and pray the following prayer. Say, Father. Say, Father. Say, my Father, my Father. I thank you for the revelation knowledge of your word in the name of Jesus. Say, Father, I receive the grace to surrender totally to the will of my creator from today in the name of Jesus. Say, Father, baptize me with the spirit of obedience that will lead to my higher dimensions in the name of Jesus. Say, Father, let all our newcomers and new converts begin to experience new dawn in all aspects of life in the mighty name of Jesus. Say, my Father, my Father, let the spirit of rising and falling in the lives of any member of our family aspire today in the name of Jesus. Say, my Father, let the love of the kingdom consume every member of this heavenly Jerusalem, thereby leading to their change of levels in all aspects of life. In the name of Jesus, say, Father, answer all your children who are waiting for the day of joy and celebration of their miracle marriage by fire this month of April. In the mighty name of Jesus, say, my Father, my Father, give uncommon promotion to all our business and career members in God City International Church this year 2024. In the name of Jesus, say, my Father, my Father, let the Holy Spirit whistle across our harvest field, thereby compelling the ingathering of multitude into this church, God City International Church, for their total deliverance in the mighty name of Jesus. Finally, say, my Father, my Father, we make a demand that all our pastors and ministers be anointed with fresh oil for divine impact, for amazing results in all aspects of life. In the name of Jesus, power to the Holy Ghost. Thank you, King of Glory. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. A better amen. amen. Stretch forth your hand as we receive the senior pastor prophetic declaration for today. The Lord shall distinguish and decorate you among your peers this season in the mighty name of Jesus. The Lord shall distinguish you and decorate you among your peers and contemporaries in the mighty name of Jesus. Three powerful amen. 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 And amen. amen. Jam your hands together and take your seat. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. You are welcome to church once again. It is time for testimony. And it is overcomers time. We have two documented testimony here to be read. And while you're listening, Almighty God shall drop yours in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Divine intervention in Zion. A big clap offering to Jesus. Praise the Lord. This is coming from Sister Blessing. Sister Blessing. She says, I want to thank God for his goodness. I want to thank God for his mercies and faithfulness over my life and family. I am here to appreciate the almighty God for what he did for me through daddy during the prayer section in one of our programs. My daughter was very sick and needed blood transmission and was swollen and could not walk. During the prayer session, daddy called out cases. I brought my daughter to the altar for prayers. And after the prayers, daddy asked me to take her to the hospital for proper medication, which we did. And the bills were paid. 
But to the glory of God, my daughter has been fully recovered and himself restored. Hallelujah. Can we give a clap offering to Jesus? Praise the Lord. Another one coming here from Mommy Adebowole. Divine healing in Zion. Divine healing in Zion. She said, I want to thank God for the salvation of my soul and divine healing for almost two weeks now. I have been having serious pains and heaviness on my left leg and left hand. At a point, I could not move them. Even when I came to church, during one of our programs, that is our possibility, I was helped to ease movement. But today, on my way back from a physiotherapy session, my son drove me to church, and immediately I stepped in. I was able to dance, but when daddy prayed for me, the heaviness on my legs and my hands disappeared immediately. Hallelujah. Glory and honor be to God. Today is our possibility again. Get set for your testimony and it shall draw for you. Shall we celebrate Jesus with a big clap offering? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shall we celebrate Jesus with a big clap offering? Can you clap your hand for Jesus? Celebrate him in appreciation of what he has been doing. Give him all the glory. Give him all the honor. Someone worship your maker this morning. Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the ending. The almighty God, I am that I am, the unchangeable changer. Lift your voice unto him and worship his holy name. Lift your voice unto him and adore him. He's our helper, he's our salvation, he's our sanctifier, he's our baptizer. He's almighty, he's unmovable God. There is no one that can move him. You can't change his position. Father, we worship you. Lord, we give you all the glory. Lord, we give you all the honor. Father, we exalt your name. The giver of life, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Our protector, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. The God of our salvation. Our helper, we thank you. Lord, we thank you. Our rock of ages, we thank you. Our mighty one, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Emmanuel, we are here to say thank you. Thank you, our Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we worship. Hallelujah. For the Lord God, whom in the potent reigneth. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah for the Lord God, O many potent rain. Hallelujah, 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 praise the Lord. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah for the Lord God, O many potent Everlasting, everlasting 
into everlasting. I will praise Him from everlasting. Everlasting to everlasting. Can you lift your voice unto the Lord and praise Him? And declare unto our Maker, I will praise you from everlasting to everlasting. Every day of my life, I will praise you. Lord, I will praise you. Lord, I will praise you from everlasting. Lift your voice unto him. And bless the name of the Lord. Give him all the glory. Bless the Lord, oh my soul, and everything that is within me. Bless his holy name. Let everything God created with you give glory to your Maker this morning. Give him all the glory. Give him all the honor. Give him all the glory, all the honor. I appreciate the God of heaven. Return glory back to him. Father, we worship you. Lord, we magnify you. Lord, we thank you. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Can you say, my father, my father. Thank you for sleeping and waking up. Thank you for the gift of life. Thank you. For preservations of lives and property. Thank you for nothing missing, nothing broken, nothing lacking. Thank you for my health and my vitality. To your Lord be all the glory. Someone lift your voice unto the heaven this morning and give him all the glory. Lift your voice unto him. Thank you, my Father, my God. Thank you for sleeping and waking up. Thank you for being alive today. Thank you for the gift of life. Thank you for health and vitality. Thank you for preservations of lives and properties. Thank you for nothing missing, nothing broken, nothing lacking. To you alone be all the glory. Lift your voice unto him. Thank you for the gift of life. Thank you because you are alive today. Thank you because you have the reason to give him all the glory. Thank you because you have the reason to give him all the glory. Father, I worship you because I am alive today. Lord, I thank you because I'm alive today. Thank you for sleeping and waking up. Thank you, thank you for the gift of life. Lift your voice unto him and thank you for the gift of life. Lift your voice unto him and thank you for health and vitality. Bless his holy name. Thank you for preservations of lives and properties. Thank you for nothing missing, nothing broken, nothing lacking. Father, we thank you. Lord, we worship 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 you. Erra da gada gada shatalia kato shata. Ella taja. Lift your voice unto him. Lift your voice and thank him for the gift of life. Sometimes the enemy look at you that you should sleep and never wake up again. But the Almighty God awake you because he so much love you. Oh Father, we thank you. You have not finished your assignment here. Oh Father, we thank you for sleeping and waking up. Thank you for the victory that you granted unto us. Lord, we give you all the glory. Harakadasha, Eliketosha, Hayadosha, Heratashata. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Jesus, the lover of my soul. Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised in all generations. There is no one like you. Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus, the owner of my soul. Alpha Omega, you are worthy to be praised. In all generation, there is no one like you. Alpha Omega. You are worthy to be praised. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. The woman of my soul. 
to me, free tree of the night, free tree of the day, free tree of the moment, to you alone be holy glory. In the mighty name of Jesus, can you lift your voice unto him and thank you for the free tree that heaven have granted unto you. Moment free tree, hourly free tree, free tree of the day, free tree of the night, oh, free tree in the morning, free tree in the afternoon, free tree in the evening. Can you lift your voice, free tree on the road? Oh, Father, we thank you, Lord, we worship you. Lord, we magnify your holy name. Lord, we give you all the glory for the free tree that you have granted unto us, the free tree you have granted unto your church, the free tree that you have granted unto our family. Lord, the free tree you have granted unto us as an individual. To you alone be all the glory. In the name of Jesus, Elato Shatalia Prada Gadosha, Elato Shatalia Rakadasha, Elia Gadasha Talia Gadesh, Arada Gadadadasha, Aragadadasha, Arata Shatalia Prada Gadosha, Elato Fitri over your children, Fitri over your family, Fitri in the office, Fitri on the road. Fitri in your environment, lift your voice unto him and thank you for Fitri. And thank you for Fitri. And thank you for Fitri. For the ticket of Fitri he granted unto us is answer prayer. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we give you all the glory. Father, we give you all the honor. Lord, we give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. Hela tashata. Herato shetalagadosha. Helete kakatagadash. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Can you say, my Father, my Father, I worship you because you are the God that answer prayer and you will answer me this morning in the name of Jesus. Can you lift your voice unto him and worship him this morning? He is the God that answer prayer and I know he will answer me this morning. He is my God when I pray unto him, he answer me. Father, I worship you because I know you are God that answer prayer and you are going to answer me today. I have my answer this morning. Leto Shata Lagadosha, Erracada Cadosha Talia, Erracada Gadadasha, Eleto Shatalia Gadosha, Erracada Gadasha, Arracada Gadagadash, Erracada Gadash, Arato Shetale Gadasha, Elacada Gadash, Elacada Gadash, Erracadosha, Elata Shakata, Erracata Dash, Arata. Shata Likadosha, Errata Dakata Gadash, Erraka Dagadasha, Erraka Dagadash, Elete Shata Liamadrosia Liagadada, Eyakata Patoshata. I have my answer this morning because I know you are called a answer prayer. I have my ticket of answer. Elidididididish, Elaria Cabajaradosh, Ekeketa Santo Sita Leketosa. You answer me last year, and you are still called to answer prayer. I know you will answer me. 
you answer my prayer daily. I thank you because I know today I have my answer. In Jesus' name we pray. Say, my father, my father, every demonic power on assignment against my pray against my answer. Cut out to this morning in the name of Jesus. Lift your voice unto the Almighty God. Every demonic power on assignment against your answer prayer. This morning I scatter you in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. When prayer goes up, answer is supposed to come down. But there are demons that are assigned to block prayers, answer prayer. This morning I scatter you. I remove you out of the way in the name of Jesus. Jesus. Every demon, every agent on assignment to delay or to delay or to delay my answer for my prayer not to be answered. This morning I scatter you in the name of Jesus. Every power that delay answer, every agent that delay answer, every demon that delay answer, every power that delay answer, to this morning I scatter you in the name of Jesus, my father, my father, every demonic power on assignment against my prayers scatter this morning in the name of Jesus every factors that can make your prayer not to be answered this morning command them to be scattered because you have your answers in Jesus mighty name we pray by the power of the almighty God every demonic every agent of the devil on assignment in order for your prayer to be delayed or not to be answered by the power of heaven this morning we scatter them in the name of Jesus we scatter them in the name of Jesus after this service you will return with your answers in the mighty name of Jesus say every power every power that have been reinforced that being reinforced to frustrate my answer prayer today be exposed and die in the name of Jesus lift your voice unto the almighty God every power that be reinforced to frustrate your answer to frustrate your answer prayer today be exposed and die in the name of Jesus every power that have been reinforced to frustrate your answer prayer today be enforced today be exposed and die in the name of Jesus every power that has been reinforced to frustrate my answer today be exposed and die in the name of Jesus every power that is causing delay to your answer prayer today be exposed and die in the name of Jesus every agent that will be reinforced to frustrate your answer today be exposed and die in the name of Jesus to in Jesus mighty name we pray see every stubborn problem 
every stubborn problem in my life, in my life, in the name of Jesus, receive solution now. In the name of Jesus, lift your voice unto God. Every stubborn problem that I've been living with you, two years, three years, four years, five years, seven years, hundred years, oh, no matter how long they have been, today receive, receive solution. In the name of Jesus, every stubborn problem, every stubborn problem that I've lived with you, longer than I know, today receive solution, receive solution, receive Every stubborn problem, every stubborn problem in my life that have been with me oh longer than necessary. Today, receive solution in the name of Jesus, my Father, my God. Every stubborn problem in my life, receive solution now in the name of Jesus. Cry unto God, no matter how long that problem has lived with you by the power of answer this morning oh today they receive solution solution this morning solutions this morning someone you are receiving solution someone you are receiving solution solution to that difficulty solution to that unanswered prayer he let take it to shatter ella prato soto shatter erra gada 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 sha ella gada gada sha he let take it to shatter erra gada 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 my father my god some problem in my life receive solution now in the name of jesus stop a problem stop a problem stop a problem stop a problem how a problem physical mental in any form in woman form today receive solution in the name of jesus someone almighty god is touching you this morning almighty god is touching somebody this morning almighty god is touching someone here this morning oh that sickness that i've been with you longer than you know this morning heaven is touching it heaven is touching it heaven is touching it that difficulty heaven is touching it he let us shatter hella gada 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 everyone is attending to someone this morning everyone is attending to someone this morning everyone is attending to someone this morning everyone is attending to someone application this morning he let us shatter ya era kakata tada hella ta shatter like it osa era gada gada sha ella ta attention is focused on someone family this morning that's stubborn problem in that family. Oh, that you have been praying to God. God, if you can just take this, I will praise you. Everyone is focused on that family. Someone is receiving testimony after this service. Some problem in your office is receiving solution now. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Every stubborn problem that have been with you longer than enough, everyone is attending to it today. And you are receiving your answer in the name of Jesus. That problem concerning that your son, that your daughter. This morning, heaven is attending to you. And you are receiving all chance solution in the name of Jesus. And that sovereign problem related to document. This morning, heaven is attending to him. There is a focus from heaven onto that document. And you will go and receive your answer in the name of Jesus. I mean a positive answer. Answer. I mean a favorable answer in the mighty name of Jesus. Say, my God, Father, my God, my Father, my God, enough is enough of stagnancy, of shame, of reproach, of poverty, of lack 
of one or backwardness. Lift your voice and mention as long as you can mention. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Enough is enough of stagnancy. Enough is enough of shame and reproach. Oh, enough is enough of prayerlessness. Enough is enough of poverty. Enough is enough of lie. Enough is enough of want. Enough is enough of backwardness. Enough is enough of rising and falling. Enough is enough of failure. Ayata shata la katakata. Enough is enough of molestation. Ilete shete keto katosha. Erakata shata. Elete kelegedere. Ayajada. Enough is enough of fruitlessness. Ile ketosha. Eratosha. Eliatosha. Iketosha. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Lift your voice unto God. Cry unto God and put a stop unto him. He let us stagnancy in my life. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Shame and reproach. Enough is enough. Molestation. Enough is enough. Poverty and lie. Enough is enough. No more backwardness. No more rising and falling. No more failure. No more disappointment. He let us shit. No more failure in life, no more failure in destiny. And novice and all, 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 and letisha, and lepatosa, and leketosa. Elakatosha, enough is enough of disappointment. Elantosita, Errata, Elakadasha. Someone crown to God this morning in my marital life. Enough is enough of disappointment. Elatosha, Errata Kata, Eleketegede, Eprada Gadosha, Elekete, Ayatosha. Someone crown to God. If but I can just touch the hem of his garment, it will make me whole. Someone touch the hem of his garment this morning. Someone rush onto the hem of his garment this morning. In the hem of his garment, there is solution. In the hem of his garment, there is solution. That woman will issue of blood of many years. When he come to say no, he said, no, she find a way just to touch him and she was made oh someone you can cry out to God this morning and put a stop for that long problem that long issue and say enough is enough I can't just go through this again he let a shooter a canto shata a rata shata in Jesus mighty name we pray this morning enough is enough for everything that you don't want in your life in the mighty name of Jesus lastly you are going to cry out to God and say my father my father my father my father in the name of Jesus David needed a stone to kill Goliath father give me a breakthrough to silence my enemies in the name of Jesus. Cry out to God. Just the prayer like that. What David needed is just a stone to kill Goliath. As the Almighty God, give me a breakthrough to silence all my enemies in the name of Jesus. What you need is a breakthrough. Hey, what you need is a breakthrough. What you need is a breakthrough. A breakthrough to silence all your enemies. Just a small stone. David silenced all the enemies. Oh, he silenced 
send the Felicia. Lord, give me a breakthrough. Give me a breakthrough to silence my enemies. Ayato shatalia katosha. Ereta shatagada. Eprata kata sato shata. Ayakada da 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 breakthrough I need to silence all my enemies. Lord, give it unto me. What David needed is just a stone. It just a stone. It just a stone. It just a stone. Father, this season, give me breakthrough to silence all my enemy. Oh, breakthrough in my answer prayer to silence all my enemies. Ayakataka da 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 da. He lent to seek a to shakele ketasha. He rakakakataka da. Hele kete kete da da da. Hera evidence is the end of all argument. Give me a breakthrough to silence all my enemies. Oh, la to shetalia. Eraka dagadosha, ele de 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 desh, ayaka dagadosha, ela katabadosha, ayaka takatosa, ele tosha, ira tosha ta, ele te kudosada. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. This year, this month, that breakthrough you need to silence the mouth of your enemy. Evil we deliver it unto you in the name of Jesus. That answer you need in order for you to prove that Jesus is alive, it will be delivered unto you in the name of Jesus. In his death, his testimonies, in his resurrection, his testimony, in his transfiguration, his testimony. Let the testimony of the life of Jesus be manifest in your life in the name of Jesus. Even dead could not hold Jesus in captive. The son of man rise and he resurrected. Enemy could not hold him. Everyone that have said that they are going to hold you down, that you are not going to rise. By the power of resurrection, arise and shine in the name of Jesus. Arise and shine in the name of Jesus. They thought that he could not rise. And they went, they were looking for him. And the angel told them, Behold, Jesus is not here. The man that you are looking for is not here. When the enemy will look at you that you are still at the bar, you are already in the front of the enemy in the name of Jesus. When they will look at you that you are still stagnated at the one position, heaven have catapulted you to your place of destiny in the name of Jesus. Someone this morning arise and shine. Arise and shine. Arise and shine. Receive your answer. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Can we celebrate Jesus as we have our seat? Hallelujah. I want to bless the name of the Lord for the opportunity to stand in the presence of the children of God this morning. I want to thank our father and our mother in the Lord in absence. That uh, thank you, God bless you, more anointing in the name of Jesus. Quickly this morning, the prophetic word of the week is, I have my answers. I have my answer. And one thing we need to know that God prophesies into the life of people through his word and through his servants. And that they have declared unto us by the options of the Holy Spirit that this week you have your answer can you put your right hand on your chest and declare unto yourself three times i have my answer i have my answer i have my answer amen this week you have your answer in the name of jesus jeremiah chapter 33 verse 3 jeremiah chapter 33 verse 3 why do you have your answer in that Jeremiah chapter 3, verse 3? He said, call unto me and I will answer thee. This is the word of God. This is the promise of God. He is the one that has said it. It's not a man that said it. A man can say, call unto me. And when you call unto the man, his phone might be switched off. And it might not be network. But the maker of heaven say, call unto me. He is the one that requests. It's a request that is placed unto you. Wherever you needed me, call unto me. And he didn't pause there. He said, and I, God, your creator, your maker, I will answer thee. Not just to answer you, I will show thee great and mighty things. Who thou knowest not. May heaven show someone great and mighty things this week in the name of Jesus. 
May everyone show someone great and mighty thing in the name of Jesus. God has promised us that once we call upon him, he will answer us. So the responsibility of a man is to call on God and answer all prayer. The responsibility of every one of us in order for us to have our answer is to call upon him. And I don't know how long you have been calling upon him and it seems that the answer is not coming. But this week, Daddy has declared unto us that I have my answer. That means all your prayer requests of 10 years, of 20 years, of 30 years, before the end of this week, we receive answer in the name of Jesus. Because his word will never drop onto the ground without fulfilling that which is made for. And the word that dropped onto the ground this morning is that I have my answer. And there shall be testimony in the life of many that are here in the name of Jesus. There are people in the Bible that have received their answer through prayer, through calling upon God. That believe on God that God answers prayer. Number one is our father Abraham. Abraham prayed for offspring. And God answered him based on the promise of God that call unto me, I will answer you. In Genesis chapter 15, verse 2 to 3. Genesis chapter 15, verse 2 to 3. And Abraham said, Lord God, what will thou give me? Seeing I go shideless, and the steward of my house is this Eliezer of Damascus. And Abraham said, Behold, to me thou hast given no seed, and lo, no one is born in my ear. The next verse. Can we have verse 4, please? And behold, the word of the Lord came unto him, saying, This shall not be thy ear, but he that shall come forth out of thy own bow shall be thy ear. Hallelujah. Abraham made the request unto the Almighty God. And God promised him, based on his promise, in Genesis chapter 21, verse 1 to 8, Abraham received the answer to his request. This morning, someone, you are receiving the answer to your request in the name of Jesus. And in Genesis chapter 21, verse 1 to 8, and the Lord visited Sarah. Someone is receiving visitations of heaven for answer prayer this morning in the name of Jesus. That your pending prayer request is receiving visitation of heaven in the name of Jesus. And the Lord visited Sarah, and he said, and the Lord did unto Sarah as he has spoken. Verse 2, and for Sarah conceived. And bear Abraham a son in his old age, at the same time of who God has spoken to him. And Abraham called the name of the son that was born unto him, whom Sarah bore, bear to him Isaac. And verse 4, And Abraham circumcised his son, Isaac being 80 days old, as God has commanded, and so on. Abraham prayed unto God, and God made a promise unto him, and God fulfilled the promise. Every promise that God has made unto you at the beginning, every prophecy that God has made unto you at the beginning of this year shall find answer in the name of Jesus. When God promises, he fulfills it. He does his own part. He does his own part, and God will fulfill all his promises upon you in the name of Jesus. Number two, Jacob. Jacob prayed for blessing, and he received answer. Joseph, Jacob's prayer for blessing. He received answer based on God's promises that say, Call unto me and I will answer you. Genesis chapter 28, verse 20 to 22. Genesis chapter 28, verse 20 to 22. And Jacob vowed a vow saying, If God will be with me and will keep me in this way that I go, and will give me bread to eat and raiment to put on, so that I come again to my father's house in peace. Then shall the law be my God. I don't know how many of us that is here today that you have said in your heart, if God can do this to me, I will give testimony. If God can answer my prayer, I will do this. If God can answer his 
this request, I will do this. And this stone, which shall serve for a pillar, shall be God's house. And of all that thou shalt give me, I will surely give the tent unto thee. And he prayed unto God. In Genesis chapter 32, verse 9 to 12, he received the answer. And Jacob said, O God of my father Abraham, and God of my father Isaac, the Lord who said unto me, Return unto thy country and to thy creed, and I will deal well with thee. I am not worthy of the least of all the mercy. You can see, of all the mercies, all his prayer requests before, I am not worthy. God answer him, and of all the truth would thou have showed unto thy servant, for with my staff I pass over unto Jordan, and now I am become to ban. Hallelujah. God will answer someone's prayer this morning in the name of Jesus. Someone you will receive answer in the name of Jesus. What of Isaiah? Number three, Isaiah. Isaiah prayed for cleansing and he received answer because God wanted to take away his sin. I don't know how many of us that have been trusting God, either online or on ground for salvation, you are addition, you are just a cry unto God, God, if you can just free me from this, if you can just free me from this, I will give you all the glory. Isaiah chapter 6, verse 5. Isaiah chapter 6, verse 5. Then said, hi, woe is me, for I am undone, because I am a man of unclean lips, and I dwell in the midst of people of unclean lips. For my eyes have seen the king, the Lord of hosts. He prayed for cleansing. And in Isaiah chapter 6, verse 6 and 7, in Isaiah chapter 6, verse 6 and 7, then flew one of the seraphim unto me, having a live coal in his hand, which he had taken with the tongue from off the altar, and he laid it upon my mouth, and said, Lo, this has touched thy lips, and thy iniquity is taken away, and thy sin is purged. Everyone believing God for salvation of soul. Everyone believing God for steadfastness of life. Everyone believing God for sanctification. Today, you will receive your answer in the name of Jesus. Next, the lepers. The leper pray for healing. And receive answer based on his willingness to be healed. Matthew chapter 8, verse 2 and 3. Matthew chapter 8, verse 2 and 3. And behold, there came a leper and worshipped him, saying, Lord, if thou wilt, thou canst make me clean. And Jesus put forth his hand and touched him, saying, I will be thou clean. And immediately, his leprosy was clean. I don't know who is listening to me this morning. If you believe him, immediately he can attend unto you. And today, that your prayer, you will have answer in the name of Jesus. You will have answer in the name of Jesus. What about Peter? Peter prayed in Matthew chapter 4 verse 30. When he was drawing, and he felt like he's going down the sea, he prayed to be saved, and he was saved. After cleaning the doubting in his mind, Matthew chapter 14, verse 30. Matthew chapter 14, verse 30. Matthew chapter 14, verse 30. I don't know what is drawing you. I don't know the circumstances that is sitting you up. I don't know the problem that it seems that you want to die in it. I don't know the gang of that it seems that everything is going to handle with it. As to call upon God this morning, you will receive answer in the name of Jesus. But when he saw the wind bestorious, he was afraid and began to sink. He cried, saying, Lord, save me. The next verse. And immediately, as you call upon God to save you from that situation today, God will attend to you immediately in the name of Jesus. And immediately, Jesus stretched forth his hand and caught him and said unto him, O thou of little faith, wherefore did thou, thou doubt? Did thou doubt? 
I don't know what is seeking you, what is bringing you down. As you call upon the name of Jesus today, you might be seeking in sickness and disease. You might be seeking in debt. You might be seeking in financial crisis. You might be seeking in gang up. But today, as you call on Jesus, I see a hand lifting you up out of every situation in the name of Jesus. Out of every situation in the name of Jesus. What about the disciples of Jesus? They pray for boldness in order to witness Jesus for everyone. And you might be praying, your prayer is that God, when am I going to get the opportunity to witness Jesus to people? In out of the Apostles chapter 4, verse 24 to 30. Out of Apostles chapter 4, verse 24 to 30. Out of Apostles chapter 4, verse 24 to 30. And when they heard that, they lifted up their voice to God with one accord and said, Lord, thou art God, who shall made heaven and earth and the sea and all that is in them is whom by the mouth of thy servant David has said, Why did the hidden range and why the people imagine faintings? The king of the house stood up and the rulers were gathered together against the Lord and again is cry for of a true again thy holy child Jesus who thou hast anointed both Herod and Postia Pilate with the Gentiles and the people of Israel were gathered together but they received answer in verse 31 verse 33 Verse 31, verse 33. I don't know the area the enemy have been intimidating you. You have been intimidated. When you see them, it's like you are having fear. You are having fear. They are even intimidating you that when you see, you try to draw, you try to do this. This morning, and no matter how they have gathered, they may have gathered against you. They may have gathered against your family. They may have gathered against the work of your hand. Today, God is giving you victory in the name of Jesus. God is giving someone answer in the name of Jesus. And when they prayed, the place was shaking. Where they were assembled together, and they were all filled with the Holy Ghost, and they speak the word of God with what? With boldness. Someone received boldness for victory in the name of Jesus. Receive boldness for victory in the name of Jesus. Receive boldness for victory in the name of Jesus. What about the Gentile woman who was sick? Who has a sick daughter? She has a sick daughter that was dying in Matthew chapter 15, verse 22 to 28. She cried unto God and she received, even though Jesus was saying that, No, this is not meant for you. And she claimed the victory for her daughter. And her daughter was made, oh, Matthew chapter 15, verse 22 to 28. And behold, a woman of Canaan came out of the same coast and cried unto him, saying, have mercy on me, O Lord, thou son of David. My daughter is grievously faced with the devil. But he answered her, not a word. And his disciple came and besought him, saying, Send her away, because she cried after us. One of the conditions I see there for you to receive answer prayer no matter what the enemy do to shut your mouth, never shut your mouth. At every point, no matter, never shut your mouth. No matter how the sickness hold you down, even if it's from your mind, you can't use your mouth to speak, never shut your mouth. But he answered and said, I am not sent, but unto the Lordship, of the house of Israel. The next verse. Then came she and worshipped him, saying, Lord, help me. But he answered and said, It is not meet to tell the children's bread and cast it to dogs. And she said, Trust, Lord, yes. Yet, dog eat of the crumbs, even if it's the little one that came out of it. Which fall from their master's table? Then Jesus answered and said unto her, O woman, great is thy faith. Be unto thee, even as thou will. And her daughter was made old from that very hour. Someone this morning, 
Receive answer prayer in the name of Jesus. Receive answer prayer in the name of Jesus. Another person that receive answer of prayer is King Asa of Judah. King Asa of Judah at the point of defeat received answer in Second Chronicle, chapter fourteen, verse nine to twelve. Chapter fourteen, verse nine to twelve. And there came out again them, Sarah the Ethiopian, with an host of a thousand thousand, and three hundred sharot, and came unto Marsa. And Asa, where Asa went out against him, and they set the battle in array in the valley of Savata at Massa. And Asa cried unto God, I don't know the battle that come in thousands, that come in many. You look at your right, that is the battle. You look at your left, that is the battle. You look at the front, that is the battle. You look at the back, that is the battle. It's like there is nowhere to run unto. Can you cry unto God like King Asa did? Can you cry? And Asa cried unto God. The Lord is God. And said, Lord, it is nothing with thee to help me. He knows for God to help me is nothing because I know you can help me. God, for you to take this shame and reproach away, it is nothing. Lord, for you to remove this defeat is nothing. Can we please have that uh, verse again on the screen? The last verse. Hallelujah. And as I cry unto the Lord, that is verse 11. And I cry unto God and said, Lord, it is nothing with thee to help, whether with many or with them that have no power. I don't want to know their capacity. I don't want to know the machinery they came with. I don't want to know the tactics, the method that they want to use. I don't want to know the objective. I don't know who is behind them. I don't know who is gathering this together. But God, what I know is that it is nothing with thee for thee to help me. Whether with many or with them that have no power. Either they are lame, either they are mature, either they are not mature. Help us, O oh Lord our God. For we rest on who? We rest on thee. And in thy name we go against this multitude. There are many. My power cannot carry it. I don't have the energy. I don't have the power. We don't have the material. We don't have the machinery. But Lord, help us. In thy name, we go against them. No matter how the gang up is, approach it with the name of the Lord. And victory will be yours. Oh Lord, thou art our God. Let no man, even they are in thousand, thousand, prevail against thee. Who can battle with the Lord and win it? No one. The next verse, please. So the Lord smote Abba. It's not we they are, they are prevailing against. Because we go in thy name, not in the name of a man, not in the name of what we have, but we go in thy name, and there is no one that ever go in the name of the Lord that ever lose any battle. So the Lord smote the Ethiopian before Asa. Every enemy surround you. Before the end of this week, they will be exposed. They will be put to shame. And they will be smoking in the name of Jesus. They will be smoking in the name of Jesus. Someone today receive answer prayer in the name of Jesus. Lastly, the church. The church. The church received answer prayer when Peter was arrested. There are testimony upon testimony of how prisoners were freed, broken or restored, among others, because of prayer of faith. Let no man doubt in his heart. God answer prayer. Psalm 50, verse 15. And he said, And call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver thee, and thou shalt glorify me. That is a guarantee of answer prayer. That is a sure 
word, word of the law. That is unshakable promises of God. Call upon me in the day of trouble. I will not put my eyes away from you. I will answer you. I will deliver you. And thou shalt glorify me. And it shall be a testimony unto your enemy that you serve a living God. Brethren, bring your petition before God. Without doubt, but with faith. Believe and trust. Be very specific in your request. Pray in the name of Jesus. Be expectant, and you will receive your answer in the name of Jesus. Things that can cause prayer not to be answered. Number one, sin. Number one, sin. Sin can cause prayer not to be answered. Number two, faithlessness. Faithlessness. You need to believe him. That he is able to do exceedingly more than even that which you request of him. You need to approach him in faith. Faith, assurance of things, offer. Confessions of things, not sin. I receive my letter. I receive my healing. I receive my victory. I receive my appointments. You speak it. You prophesy it. You confess it. Number three, doubt. You don't doubt him. He's able, abundantly able to deliver, to save, to answer those who trust in him. Don't doubt him. Don't doubt him. And lastly, impatience. Impatience, impatient, because when the answer is not yet come, you continue, you wait on him, and you press on in place of prayer. You press on in faith and in belief. Brethren, if you can do all this, you will receive your answer. You will have your answer in the name of Jesus. I want us to know that it is only God that has the power to do all things. There is no man that can do all things. It's only God that can has the power to do not all things. Not even the vessel that he is using. It's only God that has power that to do all things. God is not a magician. Neither is a houseboy that will send or error. You pray, chap, chap, and you, don't, you didn't get it. And you get angry with him. Why has God not answered me? Why has God no? He's not your houseboy that is sent or error. But be patient with God. And the answer will come in due time. Everything in the world can change, but God can never change. You will have your answer, and you go with your ticket of answer in the name of Jesus. Shall I please be on our feet and bless the name of the Lord? And give him all the glory, honor, because you have your answer this morning. You have your answer this morning. You have your answer this morning. The gentle woman whose daughter was sick, Cry unto God, even if the bread is not meant for the dog. But he said, even the dog can eat this crumb that come from his master table. Lift your voice unto God because you answer. You have your answer this morning. He has promised he will never fail. I will follow him. I will follow him. He has promised he will never fail. He is faithful. He is forevermore. He is faithful.
has promised us this morning that he's going to answer you. That he's going to answer you. His faithfulness is forevermore. He has promised. His word has come. He has promised. I will not fail you. He's not a man. Can you trust him? Can you trust him this morning? Can you lift your voice unto God and say, God, I believe and I trust you that I will receive answer to this situation. Just cry unto him this morning as promised. Man may fail you. System might fail you. Circumstances might fail you. But his faithfulness is forevermore. The best friend might fail you. People might let you down. Boy, there's a man of Calvary that will never fail you. There is a God in heaven that will never disappoint you. He said, call unto me and I will answer. You can somehow call unto God. Just make your own request. Prayer request unto God this morning. Send your prayer unto heaven as you receive answer this morning. God, in this matter, you are promised you will never fail me, Lord. Your faithfulness is forevermore. Lord, you are promised that you will never fail me. No matter what thousands gather against me, no matter impossibility before me, no matter situation that is set before me, I'm not going in the name of man. I'm not going in the name of the constitution. I'm not going in the name of anything. But we go in the name of the Lord. And they have their victory. They have their answer. So what can you believe in for victory this morning? Can you believe in for answer prayer this morning? Can you believe him for testimony this morning? Can you believe him for that your baby this morning? Can you believe him for that your husband, for that your wife this morning? Because he has promised he will never fail you. His faithfulness is forevermore from generation to generation. He promised Abraham and Mother Sarah was visited and God gave Abraham a son. What is that that he has promised you? What is that true prophecy that he has promised you? He has promised to deliver, to rescue. He has promised you of restoration. What is that that the enemy has taken away from you? Can you believe him and pray for him for restoration this morning? Lord, I believe. 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 That woman refused to go back. Even though the disciples said, send her away. She said no. And she believed God. And her daughter was touched and has a healing. That woman with the issue of blood, that's why all the crowd. She believed in the healing and the power of Jesus. She said, even but I can touch the hem of his garment. I know it will make me whole. And she touched the hem of his garment and she received her healing. What is that that you need answer for this morning? Trust God and believe God and cry unto him. In prayer, I believe heaven that your prayer answer will drop this morning. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. He has promised he will never fail me. How it draws me. I will honor him. He has promised he will never fail. He said. is focusing upon someone family this morning and you are receiving answer towards that family your faithfulness is forevermore your faithfulness is forevermore righteous father I want to thank you this morning your faithfulness is forevermore. Man may fail, system may fail, institution may fail. 
But your faithfulness is forevermore. Lord, this morning we receive our answer. We have our ticket of answer prayer. Lord, after today's service, let every attendee come back with their lorry load of testimony of answer in the name of Jesus. Everyone trusting upon you for one thing or the other. This morning you receive answer. Lord, your faithfulness is forevermore. You can't fail. Mom, I fail. Lord, you can't fail. Lord, today we have our answer. Jesus, we have our answer. We receive answer. Thank you, Father. Jesus, mighty name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Can we please have our seats? You want to surrender your life to Jesus? Everyone is waiting for someone this morning. Can you please walk to the altar and confess Jesus as your Lord and your personal Savior? His faithfulness over your salvation is forevermore. Can you place your right hand on your chest and say the following prayer? And say, righteous Father, I thank you. Because I know you are faithful to save me. I run unto you this morning. I ask for mercy. Have mercy upon me. And save me. Remove my name from the book of hell. Write my name in the book of life. I will serve you today and for the rest of my life. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Can we package our offering, our substance? His faithfulness of our finances is forevermore. It can't fail you. We answer your prayer this morning. You want to transfer? Can please transfer over them? Can we lift our offering unto heaven? Father, we declare unto your heaven. Your promise will never fail us. Your faithfulness is forevermore over our finances. Lord, let your faithfulness have impact in the name of Jesus. Bless and sanctify it in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father. Jesus, mighty name we pray. Amen. Hallelujah. Let's please listen to the following announcements. Money do continue tomorrow at the same time, the same hour, 6 a.m. Please be here and you shall be blessed in the name of Jesus. By 11 a.m. this morning is our possibility where all things are made possible. Please be in attendance and invite someone here in the name of Jesus. Tomorrow also we should not forget Man Zion hour by 5.30. And also we should join our Father in the Lord in prayer conference every 12 midnight as you attend all this Sunday service you can't miss it our prophetic service as you attend all this heaven will bless you in the name of Jesus this is your first time of worshiping with us here at God City International Church can you please be on your feet and come front as we welcome you God bless you in the name of Jesus God we honor you one of our ministers we attend to you over there as you come God bless you can we celebrate them for coming you are welcome god bless you in jesus mighty name you are welcome can we have you in the front as you walk to the front you walk over your enemy you walk over impossibility in the name of jesus you are welcome god bless you on the behalf of the senior pastor of god city international show pastor matthew morakio and pastor miss mary morakio we say welcome you are welcome to god city international show this is our national equator God bless you. And we love to see more of you. And as you attend all our program, you'll be blessed. Your life will never remain the same in the name of Jesus. Thank you. You are welcome. You can follow our minister there. He will take your detail. God bless you. Can we all rise as we share the grace? Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life. And we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. 2024, my year of new era, my year of new dawn, my year of higher dimensions. These are my portion. Amen. Hallelujah. Go and come back with your answer prayer in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. You are welcome. Expecting you. 
we can drop our offering. Expect you in our possibility by a level.